Radio. Truth is a deadly venom to a man perishing, but to a man willing to live, it's like medicine. If you want to live, then you gotta die. Are you looking for the truth or an alibi? Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to Truth Tuesday. It's been a minute since I said that, you know what I'm saying? I just been... I lost it, you know what I'm saying? I really, I really wasn't feeling Truth Tuesday anymore, and I had to take a hiatus from Truth Tuesday. I wasn't feeling it anymore, you know what I'm saying? I kind of lost my flavor, lost my the vibe, just wasn't right. Whenever I sat down in front of this camera to talk to you guys, and I don't know what that was, and I don't know what it was about, but I had to take a break. And during that break, I learned a couple of things. One, I learned that God was still using me. Even though I thought it wasn't. Even though I thought Truth Tuesday was stopped and I'm like, dude, nobody's. I watch those videos continuously get views that I'm like, you know what? The seed has been planted. So I, one thing I realized is that no matter what, even when we think we're taking the break, if we plant those seeds, God's going to provide and he's going to place those people that need to see those videos. So even though we think we're not being used, all he wants us to do is plant it. And he's going to do the rest of the work. And God was going to place the people in front of it that needed to hear the messages that were being said. The other thing that I learned was, was that, you know what, sometimes we need to get our flavor back. What that means is sometimes that the stuff that we're putting out, maybe it ain't, it ain't got the right flavor. It's not juicy enough. It's not tender enough. It's just not there enough for us to want, for people to want to feed off of it. And that led me to the scripture that I was reading, which is Matthew chapter 5, verses 13. It says, you are the salt of the earth. But if the salt has lost its taste, how shall its saltiness be restored? It is no longer good for anything except to be thrown out and trampled under people's feet. We are the salt of the earth. And sometimes we tend to forget that. And sometimes we tend to lose flavor. And when we lose our flavor, all we need to do to get that flavor back is to reconnect with the shelf. Get our ingredients back. You feel what I'm saying? And that shelf is Jesus Christ. My message to you guys today is, my question to you guys today is, is what does your flavor look like? What is your current active ingredient in your life? Do you have flavor or are you just bland right now? If you feel like you are missing some ingredients, some key ingredients, my encouragement to you guys is, is to read the cookbook. Open up your Bible. Get to know the Lord. Get connected with Him because that's what's going to give you the juiciness, the flavor that you need in your life to where people will go to where people are gonna feed off your energy. They're gonna wanna be around you. Your vibes are gonna create a hunger that everybody's gonna want a taste of. I appreciate you guys for tuning in as always. Rock what you like, not what's hype. Wash them hands, man. And remember, the shoes that we talk about on this channel, they're just bait, a way for me to share my faith. I pray that I'm an encouragement to you guys. Hit that like button, share this video, and let me know down below what are some messages that you guys want me to talk about. I love you guys, God love you guys. Peace. If it ain't about Jesus, it ain't fulfilling. Nah. I needed something that'll take the pain and kill it. Hey, yo, truth is a deadly venom to a man perishing, but to a man willing to live is like medicine.